So it seems a lot of the new Diablo fanbase are unhappy with the way the new season will work with Diablo 4. It means players will have to create a brand new character class in order to progress the seasonal battle pass that is coming soon for Diablo 4. Today I will explain all. How's it going guys? My name is DPJ and if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. So this is something I knew about ages ago and it's something I actually look forward to. I like the idea of starting at square one with everybody else and basically storming through that season pass with everybody else on an equal playing field. I also understand that if you do this and earn XP towards your season pass on a level 100 character, it means you can progress said battle pass much, much quicker than everybody else. It kind of takes away the grind, the point of it, in my opinion. But hey, that's just my opinion. Some will definitely disagree with this. I know newcomers to Diablo. Would just, I'm actually a newcomer to Diablo, by the way. Diablo 4 is my first Diablo game. But I knew about this setup ages ago. And a lot of ARPG uh, veterans will know this too. Um, I think it's a great system. But hey, that's my opinion. Let me know yours down below, like I said. So Diablo 4 seasonal content isn't far off. And it's a system I believe that's coming every three months. And we've said new seasons. If you want to progress said seasonal battle pass, you have to create a new character to progress it. This is why I picked Necromancer first. But yeah, either way, if you want to progress said season pass, if you plan on taking part in it to get all that juicy loot, you have to create a new character and start fresh at a level one. Now this all came out from Paul Tassi over on Twitter, who's unsure about this system and how it worked. He actually tweeted this, I did not do previous gen Diablo seasons, so I don't really fully get it. If I don't want to level season specific characters from scratch, can I still use my permanent ones to progress the battle pass? Here it no the question mark. Yeah, I ain't doing that then. Long term goal is to get everyone to 100 and wait for expansion, I guess. Uh, he then tweeted this uh, with a little bit of confusion, hoping for an answer from Rod Ferguson, who is the general manager on uh, Diablo 4. He replied with, Hey Paul, yes, to take part in the seasonal questline mechanics, season journey and battle pass, you need to create a new seasonal character. Playing campaign with seasonal character, if you so desire or need to finish, will also progress the season, journey and battle pass. So yes, there we have it guys, but this isn't a system new to many old Diablo players. Again, like I said, I started with Diablo 4, but I knew this would be the case. I really did. So yes, it does mean guys, if you are new to Diablo 4, if you don't know about this already, if you want to take part in that seasonal journey, you need to create a brand new character to progress said journey. It is as simple as that. Now this, like I said, many people seemingly are unhappy with. A lot of people didn't know this system existed and that it would be a part of Diablo 4. Uh, and you, you can see by the, the replies to Paul Tassi, you can see by the replies to Rod Ferguson. I mean, Diablo 4 has many, many, many new players to the franchise. I myself am included, but I actually like the idea of this. Some people absolutely dread it, which I can kind of understand. Not everybody has the spare time to basically level one full character. Never mind, create one brand new one every three months. It's not going to be possible for some players, which is totally understandable. But hey, this is how Diablo is and how it's going to stay, I do believe. I mean, you can think of it this way. You create a brand new character, you level up that season pass, you reap those rewards. You place them within your vault, people. You place them within that chest, that stash. And then you reap those rewards on your main character. I mean, that's one way you can look at it. I mean, like I said, I love the idea of everybody starting at square one with a battle pass and a journey and everyone leveling up at the same time, much like when the game released. I love that idea. I really do. And like I said earlier, it voids out people being able to progress and level quicker, the battle pass quicker, the seasonal content quicker on their main max level characters because we all know that would definitely be the case because the XP gains you can earn as a high level character is way more than what you'd earn as a fresh character. And I mean, three months people is a long, long time. I mean, it isn't like it's a couple of weeks. Three months is a long, long time. 
If you're a player that hasn't got a, well, almost endgame character three months into release, I mean, I question if Diablo 4 is really the game for you because three months is a long, long, long time. The game's been out now, what? I'm not even sure, I can't remember, I've lost track. This game has swallowed my life. Yes, I'm playing it hardcore, basically full time. So yes, I'm a little different to the people that have work, school, college, who 100% can't go on this game every day. That's to be expected, that is understandable. But still three months is a long, long time in my opinion to reach that end game. And if you're not at end game within three months, guys, like I said, I question if Diablo 4 is the game for you. So yes, this is a system, like I said, is coming very soon indeed. It's a system many players are looking forward to, and I can't wait for it myself. But I'm not gonna lie, when I do read the replies from a lot of players, some people are really, really upset with it. Even some guys, veteran Diablo players, because as we know, seasons, battle passes haven't been a thing in Diablo in the past. I mean, ARPGs, yes, this is sticking to that kind of ARPG theme with doing this. But a lot of older Diablo players ain't happy about this either. So if you go to that tweet, I'll link it down below within the video description, Paul Sass's tweet. You read some of the replies to it, guys. It's definitely, definitely a thing some players are unhappy with, which again, is fully understandable. Some players may not want to create brand new characters. Some people picked a main to be their main. They want to progress all future content on their main again this is something i fully understand too and i wouldn't be upset if uh diablo 4 and blizzard did a complete 180 on their decision to do the battle pass and the season journey like this but i'm pretty sure time will tell guys again like i said some people are happy with this i'm quite happy with it i don't really mind but some people are seriously seriously upset with it guys let me know your thoughts down below within that comment section are you happy to create a brand new character just for the purposes of this seasonal battle pass if you don't create a new character you cannot progress this let me know your thoughts down below people do you think this will be a system blizzard go back on do you think it's a system they'll do a complete 180 on i mean i personally can kind of see happening if enough of an uproar is caused i mean there's still time to do this but in my personal opinion i do think blizzard know best and i do think having to create a brand new character a seasonal character is probably the best route but hey that's just my opinion i'm excited for it either way guys the end of the video has arrived if you enjoyed it leaving a like really helps add if you like what you see and want to see more be sure to subscribe and hopefully guys i'll see you on that next one